love the most about this bikini is that it has all of these different extra loops on it that go around your body so it looks like it's kind of caged around your waist and just kind of cinches everything in and just adds interest to the bikini instead of it just being like a plain normal bikini it's just got a little something extra and then the second suit that i got from fashion nova is this red one this is also a monokini I just love all of the cutout details in this suit. I love the plunging neckline here, so you can have like a little bit of cleavage in the middle, and that would look really cute. And then I just love all of the, um, like, what do you call this? Caged? Caged. That's what I meant. So I like how it's caged, and it just um, accentuates all of your curves. Again, this one doesn't have um, a ton of coverage over the butt but this one I think has just a small amount more than the blue one did. <laughs> what is this right now? I don't know. First of all, this one is size eight. It said D through double D. Um, this one does not have as much coverage as I would like it to have. It looks, it looks decent here on camera, but in person I feel pretty uncomfortable with this whole situation here. Um, I think that the design was really cute and that's what initially drew me to wanting to grab this bikini because it's a little different. It, like, I love the crochet pattern on it. I love the color. It's also ungodly tight around my waist. I don't know how that is because I'm a size 32 around the waist and this is just super, super tight and I just don't feel like I could feel comfortable wearing this. The only thing is, is it's very, very thin material. It's like the thinnest swimsuit material I've ever felt. And so also at first I was like, mm, okay. But because it's black, it works. I don't know what it is. It's just so flattering on my body. Um, I got it in a size long, easier to pull it up, uh, so it was a little bit more up on my hips, and it also had the ruching in the back where it has the scrunch bum, so I felt like that would be a little bit more flattering as well. Um, I got these in a size large, apparently, and they fit pretty well. One of the most flattering bottoms that I picked out. The only thing is that with the seam, it folds over quite a lot. So this bikini, I love the like wine color of this one. I wish that these bottoms were a little bit, like you could pull them up a little bit higher, like right here would be perfect, but I think they're supposed to be worn like normal low rise, but I just kind of jacked them up a little bit. They have like moderate coverage on the back, which I really, really like. I feel very comfortable in. I love the like tank top style with the knot. I feel like it's so cute and so flattering. Feels really nice. I got all of these bikinis, by the way, in a size medium. So everything that you see today is size medium. I will leave all of my measurements in the description box below so that you guys can kind of compare as to what size would work. Locked bikini set. This is a two-piece set and it has a simple design with a beautiful floral print. I like that it's a v-neck pullover style top and also features high-waisted full coverage bottoms. I really love the design and print on this bathing suit and I feel like it would look goes up a little bit higher and creates more of a double cut out on the side and gives you the ability to really really cinch in your waist and create. I don't love low-rise bottoms on myself but luckily with these ones I can hike them all the way up my crack and cover my cupcake holsters. Next up is the Antigua style, and this one says to me, she's here to party. I see a lot of knockoffs of these ones from cheaper brands. It's a very, very popular style, and I can see why. It's absolutely gorgeous. I got two different colors of this one, the red and the metallic. Both tops are size 32 to 34 double D, which is my sister size, and medium size bottoms. This one has underwire and then also has adjustable tie closures. I mean, it does have a decent amount of coverage, but it is still pretty revealing for someone of my size, if you know what I mean. Um, so, I mean, I definitely wouldn't feel very comfortable kind of jumping around on the beach, but this is really cute for picture's sake, I suppose. It was just kind of bizarre to tie, as you guys can see in the back. It's just like, well, it's kind of folded over. I can't. I can't. I can't. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, this one definitely feels a lot more comfortable for me and a lot more of my style. 
Um, I like that it has this extra lining underneath that gives you just a little bit more coverage. I feel like I'd feel comfortable wearing this to the beach. Like, I don't feel like anything's gonna pop out if I bend over. Um, it feels very secure, and I always talk about how, like, when I have a good bra, I wish that they made that into a swimsuit because I feel like all other swimsuits I've ever worn have just been, like, total, like, I just feel like everything's gonna fall out. So... I really really like this and I like that it also has kind of double straps here and the straps aren't super duper thin they're a little bit thicker so they give you a little bit more support and you're not just having something hang from the back of your neck because in general my neck will start to hurt or I'll get like a really deep line there from tying it so tight trying to like hold everything up so this one has underwire built into it as well it's definitely not see-through you don't have to worry about that I love the coverage that I get from this one. Like, I feel like this is a super flattering bikini top for my body type, for sure. Kind of come down on its own. It just feels so tight on my shoulders, too. Like, there is no way that anyone with a D or double D chest would ever be able to fit into this. Like, otherwise, it's really, really cute. I would have liked it if it were bigger because the bottoms are really cute, too. They're, like, high-waisted. Like, these bottoms, I could I could get on these bottoms. Like, they're not terrible. I really like the front design, and I like how high-waisted they are. But this top, what is going on in the world? Like, the other one fit me way better than this one did, and I just don't understand 